Hi, I'm Mahin Kasor for The Gamer and here's the best ways to get money in Pokemon Legends Arceus. In the months after the new year, money can be tight. But don't worry because I've got a few surefire ways to make some of that sweet poker dollar. Oh, you want real money advice? Sorry, I got nothing. There's a few different ways to make money in Pokemon Legends, so let's have a look at some and make your decision on which ones you want to use. These sparkling tumble stone always have stardust inside, so they're always worth breaking. And if you aren't already, catching Pokemon and filling up that Pokedex gets you money too. For a game with trees everywhere, there doesn't seem to be much wood. So whenever you see wood lying around, be sure to pick them up as when formed into a Pokeshi doll, sells for 1000 polka dollars. And now that all of those are out of the way, here's what you really need to do to make some of them polka dollars. Alpha Pokemon can be tough to take down, and that's why the rewards are always so plentiful. But we found nothing quite as quick and easy as this Alpha Roserade found in the Crimson Mylands. Once you're here, fast travel to Brava Arena. Go down the steps and follow the path straight ahead and you'll find the budding alpha Pokemon right here. Once you defeat it, it drops a seed of mastery which goes for 3000 poker dollars. Great gravel which is worth a measly 200 poker dollars. But most importantly, it drops an EXP L which goes for 4500 poker dollars. Roserade, more like Rosa make it rain. Space time distortions will start to appear in the game after you reach star rank 2. They're a big ball of wibbly wobbly timey wimey stuff and a great way to find interesting Pokemon and items which can sell for a reasonable amount. They spawn after you've been in an area for long enough with the 40 minute mark guaranteeing you for one to spawn. Once you're inside, you have the chance of finding items such as nuggets, stardust, comet shards and evolutionary items. Make the most of space time distortions when they appear as they are pretty random, but for our final method, Here's something a little bit more reliable. Now this method works better if you're in the post game, something I one day eventually will get to. But anyways, this method involves the misfortune sisters, which is ironic as they are pretty fortunate. In the obsidian field lands, there's a chance any one of the sisters will battle you at any one of these three points. So have a look at this and mark your map the same. The first place is here, marked right next to the D in Deer Track Heights. The next one is next to the Y of Nature's Pantry, and the final one is north of that one, a little over here. They'll roughly be around these marked areas, so make sure to have a little look around each one before checking the next one. Their Pokemon's levels scale depending on how far through the story you are, and it really is only worth doing if you're at the post game. As before that, they only drop Stardust, which goes for a thousand Poke Dollars, but after, they drop Nuggets, which are worth 10,000 Poke Dollars. We all love a good nug. Um, so I've heard. And that's all the advice I got on making money in Pokemon Legends Arceus. Post your other best ways to make money in the comments. And as always, I've been Mahin Kasor for The Gamer. And for more Pokemon Legends Arceus guides, keep checking thegamer.com. See ya!